Hey Scorpio. So I want to give a special thank you to all of my Patreons, everyone that has subscribed to that. If you would like to subscribe to my Patreon, then the link to that is down below. Also, if you would like to um, check out my vlog channel, then the link to that is down below as well. Universe, what is the energy surrounding Scorpio? What is the energy surrounding Scorpio, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus signs? Okay, this is weird. Like, I think two signs that I've done today, the Ten of Swords has come out the first card, and you guys, it just did again. Like, I definitely feel, and it makes sense since it's like towards the end of the year and just all of this, I really feel that there's a lot of endings and new beginnings happening for everyone. Um, we do have these Six of Wands here. So I feel that something for you is going to work out. I really feel for a lot of you guys with the Seven of Swords here and the Ten of Swords, you could be ending a toxic situation. So whether this is a toxic situation in a relationship, a toxic situation in work, whatever it is, I um, see you guys ending it and I do feel you're going to move forward because of it. What is the energy surrounding Scorpio? Wow. I'll just ever hear weird shit. Okay, anyway. So we have the Knight of Cups here with the Five of Cups. Wow, so it definitely feels somebody is coming to offer an apology. Could be another water sign, uh, Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio. I'm also getting strong fire energy here as well. Could be an Aries, but somebody is going to come apologize to you. Um, I do feel that somebody wants closure now. With the Ten of Swords here and the Seven of Swords here, I don't feel like this person is being genuine at all, but I do feel like you guys are going to pick up on that. However, that's just something to look out for. We do have the Temperance card here with the Lovers, so I really see a very healthy relationship. Either um, could be your current relationship that is very healthy. I see you two growing a lot closer, um, or this could be a new relationship coming into your life with the Lovers card here. This is Soulmate. Um, and twin flame energy. I definitely feel somebody very important is coming into your life with the temperance card here. This could be a Sagittarius, but this is also healing. So I do feel like um, whatever is ended in your life, I do feel like you are going to heal or you guys have been um, moving forward with some sort of healing. Okay, yeah. We have the strength card here with the Knight of Swords. You could be getting a message from a Leo or an air sign. I really feel with these people, though. They're coming up as knights. I feel like you have a lot of... I feel like a lot of people want you. I do feel like for a lot of you guys with the lover's card here, I feel like you guys are in a relationship or are already talking to someone. I just feel like a lot of people want your attention, want to talk to you, want to reach out to you, want to ask you out. I feel like you're going to be getting a lot of that this month. Like It's almost like a spotlight's on you, uh, especially with the Six of Wands here. A lot of people... Um, or just, um, I almost want to say a lot of people are like obsessed with you. Like, I don't feel like it's in a dangerous way or anything like that. But I do feel like a lot of people just, I like what you're doing. Maybe you do stuff on social media. Maybe you're just very much so in the public eye, whatever it is. I feel like you're going to be getting a lot of attention. Wow. Okay. So we have the Ten of Cups. This is happiness. I see you being satisfied, especially in a relationship. I see you being very satisfied. Um, I never really noticed the kids playing in the back of this card. So I do feel like um, some of you guys could be adding an additional person to your family. Like if you already have kids, I feel like you're going to be having another child. Or even if this is your first child, I do feel like some of you guys um, could be pregnant or somebody very close to you could be getting pregnant. Okay. We have the King of Cups here. I, feel, I just see you guys very much so um, in your energy, in your element. I see you, a lot of you being very, very successful and very happy. Like Scorpios, like, well, on my channel, a lot of Scorpio readings I've done have been very positive. So I do feel like um, kind of same with this one. I feel like things are really being put together for you. I see a lot of success. Whatever you're doing, whatever you're pursuing is successful or will be very successful. So advice is definitely to continue to do that but I definitely feel whatever this toxic situation was it could have even been just a friendship really needed to end or if like you're on the fence right now like okay should I just let this go should I just stop talking to this bitch like if that's going through your mind it advises to listen to that feeling so I hope that this was a good reading for you if you would like a personal reading then you can go to my website swordstarot.com and uh, yeah enjoy the rest of your day